between 10 o'clock and 11 o'clock. If you want to supercharge this, if you trade on the days that in a weekly profile, meaning where, for instance, a classic bullish weekly profile would be a Tuesday low of the week in London. Okay. If you used a market environment that has a seasonal tendency for the market that you're trading, we'll say ES. Okay. If you are in a seasonal tendency for the ES to trade higher for the next couple of weeks, you should be really trying to do most of your analysis with that expectation to try to look for longs. And if that is the case, if you are trading on Monday, Tuesday, and if the low really hasn't materialized in a stunning fashion by Wednesday, Wednesday's New York session like this, the tendency for you to capture a big move is there using that weekly profile. Trading inside of this 11 o'clock, I'm sorry, 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock time window. Those silver bullet trades will be phenomenal. Because what are you doing? You're participating in a larger, higher time frame price run based on a weekly expectation inside of a seasonal tendency that is in alignment with the side of the trade you're taking, whether it be a bullish seasonal tendency or bearish seasonal tendency. Whatever you're doing at that time, you're really placing everything on, in your favor in that direction. So you can really supercharge your trades with this little window. It's not like this takes you out of those types of trades or one shot, one kill trade. No, you can participate in them with this, the supercharging aspect in layman's terms and now close by using higher time frame analysis and you're expecting larger range on a short term to swing basis. In other words, a trade that lasts several days to a couple weeks. If you use this 10 to 11 trading in the ES market or NASDAQ and you know, let's take a look at the, the NASDAQ. See if it materialized there. But by incorporating a higher time frame element to it, you can have a participation in those bigger price runs. And instead of taking all of your trade off at five handles or whatever your target would be for that liquidity within this 60 minute window, that you can take a portion off and leave like one contract on and leave it as a runner 